This is Kevin Holden here with Steve Kerr and Clark Kowal and our sideline reporter, Doris Burke. Welcome, everyone. It's the Phoenix Suns and the Denver Nuggets. Our starting lineup to look at the matchups here and who we'll see for our starting five for both teams. And, guys, what are we going to be looking for in this one? Nurkic. You know, Kevin, he never gives up on a play. That's what I love about him. He just is one of those guys who will bring effort and energy the entire 48 minutes. And, Steve, you know, he's also got a full arsenal of moves in the post. I mean, you can't believe how many tricks this guy has up his sleeves. He's full of them. You look at them. They're facing elimination, and the fans in this building know that this could be their last game of the year without a tremendous effort. Things are looking awfully bleak, no doubt about that. They've got an uphill struggle, but it all starts with just one game. Just win one time, and then get a little momentum, and you never know what can happen. And, and that's kind of the situation. I think the important thing is for them to get off to a quick start in this game, get these fans into it, and prevent any kind of anxiety or unsettled atmosphere from setting in. A good way to get things started here. Steve, always nice to get the first points up on the board. At least I felt that way. There's a good screen. And on the way from Irving for three, he hits. And Phoenix will come the other way. They are pumped right now after a big win on Sunday. Tell you what, the way they shot the ball that game, Kevin, it looked like a shoot-around out there. <laughs> it sure did, and all the more impressive because they did it on the road. You're not supposed to be able to get that high in an opponent's building. So, and the three ball is good. Great opportunity right there. He's got such tremendous length. He can just rise up and get separation for the three. All right, let's go over to the sideline with Doris Burke. Look, Kevin, I had a chance to catch up with the head coach for the Suns. What he stressed to his team in the locker room was that they can't go into this game thinking they've got room for error just because they'll have another chance to close it out in their building should they lose. He said that would be the absolute worst possible mindset for us. We'll know early how they're thinking, guys. Thank you, Doris. And Denver has possession after the made shot from Russia. And it's Irving missing. And it is very dangerous to leave him open like that. Lucky break for the defense that he missed it. LeBron gets to smart. Second chance effort. And Zabuki. Good. Strong rebounding, and he's rewarded with the easy putback. We're just about two minutes into the first quarter. Irving with the ball. And the pass to Hunter. Pulls up on the elbow, and the officials whistle a foul on the shot. The bucket's good. will go to the line. And this is his first trip to the line tonight. That free throw good from Hunter. Phoenix is gone. One of three from beyond the arc so far in the game. Smart dishes to LeBron. It's Wesley on the win. And the officials call over the back. A little too aggressive there. Not much doubt about that over the back call. Yeah, he was all over his back that time. Looked like he was going for a piggyback ride. Right? Passes it to Hunter. Nurkic. Jackson on him. Some nice ball movement by the Nuggets. Not really his range, and it's off target. Wesley with the ball. Now guarded by Hunter. And as a bookie, kicks to Smart. Jackson setting the pick here for Smart. And it's Phoenix scoring again. Very effective screen to set up the jumper. And that was the key to that play. The Nuggets trail by three. Pass to Sarge. It's up a three. Denver gets it back. The kick out to Irving. Pass to Sarge. A three ball. Here's Rukic. And the officials call goaltending, so they'll award the basket. He thought he had that one clean, but the ref saw it differently. They'll count the basket. Suns have gone 4 of 7 from the field, shooting over 50%. LeBron passes to Wesley. Back to LeBron. He dishes it to Smart. And as a bookie, kicks to Wesley. He feeds it to Smart. And there's the pass to Azubuki. Wesley with the ball. Now the dish to Smart. Azubuki is free on Irving. LeBron, left side. 
There's the triple. And that one's good. LeBron's got six. Well, you can't leave him alone, especially from long range. The Nuggets trail. There's the pick. Irving gets to Sarge. No good on the three. You know, he's been off his game this quarter just a bit. Hasn't been able to get a whole lot to go so far. And out of bounds is the Nuggets game possession. Now we have a chance. Let's go to the 2 k leaderboard with the list of the best rebounding teams in the regular season. The Suns third. What a tremendous regular season for them on the board. I mean, they never seemed to fade during long games and kept grabbing rebounds until the final whistle. They played 48 minutes of basketball, and they'll expect to do the same thing here in the postseason. A wide open three. They need much better communication defensively. Here's West. LeBron outside. He passes to West. Feeds it to Smart. Bucket six. Baseline jumper. Will not go. This is off the front. It's going to be out of bounds. The Suns will retain possession. Pass to West. The feed to LeBron. From deep. Defensive rebound. Foul call that time on the way up. That'll give him two chances at the free throw line here. Great job. Taking him right at the defense. I like the aggressiveness. Yeah, he left him no choice but to foul there. The Suns shooting their first free throws here tonight. have gone 4 of 10 shooting the ball here in the first quarter. They swipe it. Here's West. Defended by Hunter. Rejected by Hunter. We know he's going to be the focus point for them in this one, fellas. I can feel it. Yeah, it's a physical game, and so far the numbers show that they've got the edge on the glass. Denver with the ball. Trailing by two. Great defense there. You really have to challenge him at that range. Releases. And it's Wesley missing. Well, it's just been one of those kind of games, though. Moving against Wesley. That ties the game. Irving's got his first bucket of the night. Some shooting in his first trip. Around 38%. They're looking a bit creaky out there. He's smart. Tried to bank it in, but he misses. He has just disappeared this quarter, not making a mark at all offensively. And I'm sure he's ready to put this quarter behind him and quickly. Now you can see why the defense is willing to let him take that shot. That's really not his range. Suns moving the ball around. It's Wesley on the wing. Dishes it to Smart. Kicks it to LeBron. And the Suns miss again. And here we go with Kyrie Irving. Winslow. Lots of room. And it's off the back rim. No good. Tries to keep it alive. Back to LeBron. He kicks it to Smart. Pass to West. He dishes it to Smart. LeBron outside. And again, LeBron missing. And here comes Irving. The pass to Hunter. From past the arc. And it's Phoenix with the rebound. LeBron kicks to Smart. Pass and it's LeBron picking up the assist. Smart's got his second bucket of the game to go. Boy, great job of attacking on the break. Yeah, it sure was. He made a beeline for the bucket as soon as they got the ball. Right away, straight to the rim. Timeout is called. First of the game for the Nuggets. Well, they've really kind of struggled offensively here. So I think this timeout is for him to 
Really draw something up, maybe get an easy two and get their confidence back. You know, sometimes an easy basket out of a break is just what you need to get things back on track. And coaches always have plays specifically for that situation, coming out of timeouts for an opportunity to get a buck. Here's Johnson. Harris outside. And two free throws coming up as he misses that one. Drawing the whistle on a lot of times right there. And he's got his first free throw of the game. First one falls for him. They're shooting just 35 percent to start the game. Outside Green. Pass it to Abdiya. Number 16. Wide open shot is on the money, and the Suns lead by two. Boy, such outstanding patience and decision making for them offensively. Yeah, absolutely. Their ball movement has been outstanding. They are piling up the assists. Now here's Johnson. Pass to Nance. Back to Johnson. He feeds it to Mills. Four on the shot clock. Williams with the block. Here's the 24 second shot clock violation, so they'll turn it over. And it's Phoenix's ball. Working on Nance. The jump hook, and the Suns tack on two more. You know, he's got a lot of inches on the defender in that matchup, and he can just shoot right over the top of him without worrying about being bothered. Nance, right side. Lays it up and banks it in. The Suns leading. Up here. This now to Williams. Right side green. Is again. Williams shot is off. But other shooting just 35% to start the game. Feeds the Barton. Seven foot shot. That's in there. Johnson with the assist. Barton's got his first two points of the night. And of all the things about him uh, that you like offensively, it's his composure that jumps out at me. That way he never gets rattled. You know, the defense can get in him. He doesn't care. He just continues to do his thing. That's true. And this spectacular shot block and something else to look for, especially recovering on the break. He can run you down and send it away in a heartbeat. A three-pointer is right on target. Martin's got five. Suns trail by three. Clark, they've been looking out of sync offensively. You know what? A basket here would do a lot for their confidence. Here's Matthew. And he was fouled in the act of shooting. Chance in now for a three-point play. He clearly had the speed advantage there. And he used it to burn the D for the sweet hoop. Nice play. And let's get your two guys on the scoring breakdown for the Nuggets. Now, they didn't waste any time getting into the groove out there. They're dialed in from long range. Something else they've done right so far from the get-go tonight is, is run. I mean, so much of their offense has come off the fast break. Time call here. The Nuggets decide to talk it over. And here's Mills. There's 138 left here in the opening quarter. Harris outside. Now the feed to Nance. Back to Harris. Green with the block. Leaps for it. But they recover it. Just three to shoot. And they turn over the 24 second buzzer, signaling the shot clock violation. And there on your screen are some of the top dual threats during the regular season. The point guards with the most success from three. You look at Mills, second in the league, extremely accurate from beyond the arc. 
Well, if there are no other options available, any of these guys can just step back and shoot the three. A great backup plan for any point guard to have. Yeah, I'd love to see a three-point shooting contest just amongst the point guards so we could watch these guys do work. I mean, I don't know which one of them I choose, but they're all pretty good. Sun shooting 39% in the early minutes of this game. Dishes it to Green. The train. That's good. And it's a three-point Suns lead. The Nuggets shooting in this first quarter. Around 38%. They're looking a bit creaky out there. Expanding his range. That's good for Harris on the assist by Mills. Harris has got five. This is great. Three pointers going down quickly at both ends. Yeah, it took them no time to answer back on that possession. Outside green. For three. And the Suns get it back. There's Williams. That's good. Williams has got his second bucket. Those are the kind of nice inside looks they've gotten in the first half here. And I think they should really continue to work it down low, Clark. That's really going to free up the rest of their offense. Here's Mills. Here's Harris. Harris missing again. Number 16. A three-pointer off the mark. From deep three-point range, and the release was before the buzzer, but it's off target. So at the end of one quarter of play, still a close game. The Suns on top, up two. And the second quarter will get underway just after this short break. First round of the Eastern Conference playoffs. Go up against the Orlando Magic this Thursday, 7 o'clock Eastern. Welcome back to game four as we get ready to start things up again. And a closer look here at the scoring breakdown for the Suns. How about the work on the offensive glass to this point, guys? The other thing that's helped them early tonight are the points they've been able to convert off turnovers. The Nuggets trail. And a chance here presented by Gatorade to see who's on the floor. All fueled up and ready to go for the start of the second quarter. On the court for the Suns. And this show, that one drops. Johnson's got the first basket of the second quarter for the Nuggets. The Suns shooting around 31% in the night. Kicks to Joseph. Jacks up a three. A rebound by Johnson. The Nuggets shooting 40% from the field. He passes to Barton. It's stolen by Green. Jumps up. And a big jump at the end of the break. Textbook example there of how to use defense to create offense. Yes, beautiful transition play after the steal all the way to the basket. Wasted no time going from defense to offense. Yeah, it feels like they're starting to pick up the intensity as the game itself starts to get a little more tight and close. And so he earns a trip to the line. Officials saw the contact and he'll shoot two. The Nuggets have gone three for three at the line tonight. First one drops. And both free throws good for Mills. Here in the second quarter with uh, a little over a minute gone. Now here's Joseph. Covered by Mills. Here's Clarkson. It's rebounded by Mills. Under in the lead. 
Harris outside. Mills. Back to Harris. Rebound by Williams. Williams has got his third rebound on the night. The drive by Green. And a foul on the shot. He'll go to the strike for two. Obvious foul. Yeah, he took a hit right there and earned those free throws. The Suns shooting their fourth and fifth shots at the foul line in the game. That one is off. And the Suns with a completely new group on the floor. Good on the second. The Nuggets shooting a lackluster 38% for the game, struggling so far. Outside Irving. Winslow. And he drops in the way up off the glass. And the Nuggets lead by two. We're now about two minutes into the second quarter. Here's Carson. Carries it from three-point range. And we've got an injury out on the floor. Very unfortunate as always, guys. Uh, don't like to see this. Mm, injuries are such a difficult part of this game. And from a glance, you really can't tell just how bad it is. But he's going to come out, and we'll find out now how bad it is. He may be done for the game. Will Barton, he's checked in for Denver. And for the Suns, Jackson comes in for Williams. And it's LeBron in for Green. Irving passes to Sarge. Good ball being here by the Nuggets. The pass to Hunter. He on the clock. Accurate with a jumper from the elbow. Eight points for him. Clark and Steve, this tug of war game continues. You know what? And they just keep flip flopping the lead again and again and again. Yeah, how about the, that last lead change? That's, that's number seven for the game. Jackson gets to Azabuki. That's good, and it's Jackson with the assist that time. As the boogie's got five. The Nuggets have gone three of four from the four here in the second quarter. Passes it to Hunter. Here's Saric. Three-pointer. Irving kicks to Barton. Pass to Rukic. Barton, covered by LeBron. Barton dishes to Irving. Irving gets a screen on Nurkic. Here's Hunter and the powerful one-handed slam. Boy, taking it hard to the rack for the big throw there. And give an unofficial assist block to his teammate for setting the screen that freed him up. And he him. That was really the key to the play. He kicks it to the ground. Here's Clarkson. Denver grabs the miss. Sarge has got his fourth rebound with that last one here tonight. Outside Irving. The pass to Hunter. Back to Irving. Here's Sarge. Fires from deep. And it's hauled in by LeBron. Even with every shot clanging off the rim, he seems determined to keep hoisting up these three. It might be time to get inside of that arc. Marky talked about a back-and-forth game. This is the definition of yeah, it. Yeah, no doubt about it, Kevin. I mean, not even through the first half, and it's been one heck of a back. Well, these are the kinds of games you love. I mean, two good teams going head-to-head in an even matchup, and both sides very competitive on their toes tonight. There's the three. That's good. LeBron's got nine. The lead changes hands once again. There has been... No separation between these two teams tonight. What an intriguing basketball game, that's for sure. Passes it to Hunter. Outside Irving. Here's Saric, defended by Joseph. Nurkic and Denver again with the bucket. That's a nice job of getting the ball on the paint and burying the shot. That's exactly how it's done. Time out for injury report. The news is not good at all. It looks like a broken ankle with additional to the surrounding connective tissue. A tough break if he were to miss any time as
as the playoffs are still getting underway. Everyone hopes to be 100% at this time of year, Kevin. Thank you, Doris, for the update. We appreciate it, and we really hope for the best as always. Well, knowing him, Kevin, I bet he can put it behind him as quickly as possible. Let's hope so, Steve. I know everybody's looking forward to seeing him back out there. Joseph, the pass to LeBron, fires from the ring. Another one falls for Phoenix. He's created some good opportunities for himself and made the most of them. Irving with the ball. Picked up by Joseph. Good on the triple. Martin's got eight points. A little confusion defensively. Yeah, hey, you know what? He sent the D a little message with that three. Timeout called. The Suns. Well, he's got to get everybody on the same page. I mean, that's the reason for this timeout. And if that happens, I think they can improve and start playing better. You know, it's a coach's job to always try to be two or three steps ahead of the opponent and to look for that extra edge if you can. And I think he feels like he might have seen one. Here's what Phoenix has got going on right now. Wesley's checked in and Smart subbed in for Corey Joseph. Suns have gotten seven of their 12 field goal attempts to drop here in the second quarter. Up over 50%. Smart kicks to LeBron. Defended by Barton. Launches a three. And LeBron James good for three. LeBron's got eight here in the quarter. You know, he started out hot, and he's only gotten hotter. He, he could be in for one of those games. Hunter covered by Wesley. Here's Hunter. Again, the Nuggets score. The offense has a better flow, and it actually looks better here in the second quarter. Yeah, they've steadied themselves a little bit, trying to close this gap. Smart kicks to LeBron. Here's Sarge. Five points in the game. Hunter covered by Wesley. Hunter, the pass to Irving. Stolen by Smart. A rolling two-handed jam. He can fly, can he? He'll make you forget he's a point guard sometimes. Yeah, fly. when he does decide to attack the basket, Kevin, he can do it with the best mm. of them. And this is the time to attack with, with these two teams locked in such a close game. Denver calls timeout. Look at LeBron James. He's really been playing well. They don't seem to have any answers for him. They need to review their game plan and look for a way to cool him off. Well, no question the players you see listed here. The assist leaders at small folk were some of the best passers in the league outside the point guard position. LeBron James, number one. He sees the whole court extremely well. And from the wing, it's that vision that enables him to penetrate and find the open man, even in a very crowded area. The drive, draw, and ditch. I call that the 3D element. Is his bread and butter. I mean, a lot of young small forwards out there can learn a thing or two from watching this guy do his work. Nurkic crosses the hole, down to five on the shot clock. It's off his foot, and they're saying he kicked the ball. Suns on defense. They lead by four. Here's Irving. It's rebounded by Wesley. LeBron James on the wing. Off the pick. LeBron with another miss. Couldn't convert. A nice little two-man game there. And it wouldn't surprise me to see them go back to that the next trip. On its way from Irving for two. And again, Denver no good. Suns lead by four. From the arc. Another three for Phoenix. Most any NBA player can make you pay when you leave them that wide open. That's why you have to stay alert on defense. He passes it to Nurkic. From 10 feet out, rebounded by Azubuki. Azubuki's got his seventh rebound of the game with that last one. They are really getting the work done inside with their rebound. Now, not giving up too many second-chance opportunities, which is always important. And it's been one of the reasons they have the lead right now. Denver's gone two for five from three-point land since the end of the first. They set the pick. Shot to stop the run. And Jackson with the block. Wesley with the ball. Now defended by Barton. He dishes it to Smart. 
Puts the lead pass in front of him. Now Clark, a clear line to the basket and the emphatic jam. And that is outstanding attacking basketball. Well, he had no choice but to take that one to the bucket. Nurkic, guarded by Jackson. Nurkic has his desires. Shoots. The shot is up. And Phoenix will come the other way. This has not at all been the kind of performance they've needed out of him. Smart kicks to Wesley. Another three for Phoenix. It was a slow start for him. But he started to take off since we hit the second quarter, guys. Guys are looking for a spark here. Yeah, I mean, a cold stretch offensively. They desperately need a basket. Irving passes to Sarge. The Nuggets with another miss. They're losing their composure a little bit here on the bad end of the run. Yeah, they are, and they need to come up with a rally-wrecking play here to stop this run. And he hits it and gets hacked on the play. A three-point possibility if he can convert the free throw. They're playing with a purpose, guys. The big lead becoming bigger. I like the look in their eyes. And it's on both ends that they've been controlling the action. Pushing up on the changes for Denver. Nancy's checked in for Sarge. And it's Mills in for Will Barton. The Nuggets trail by 17. Pass to Lukic. There's a minute 34 left now here in the second. Now the pass to Hunter. Lukic. Solid play in the low block, and that one's good. Six points for him. Superb assist there. He played the role of the maestro on that one. Williams has a screen for LeBron. He feeds it to Smart. He's covered by Irving, and Irving comes to help. Number 16. Off line with his three. Smart dishes to LeBron. There's 49 seconds left in the first half of the game. Number 16. Oh, good on the triple. Denver's gotten cold from deep in the second quarter. Just two or six from long range. No one near him. And the shot is good. 14 points for him. Well, he's been a real positive factor for them today. Although, you know, as a team, they've had a lot of negatives mixed in there as well. LeBron kicks to West. Back to LeBron. Gets the three-pointer. LeBron's got 17 now. Yet another three for him, Kevin. He's really been draining him here in the second. Mills passes to Irving. The dish to Mills. Let's it go with a three. No one. Here's LeBron. The shot, no good. And so a pretty lopsided game to the first half. Suns lead by 16. From the Pepsi Center in downtown Denver, we're back in a moment. And now, brought to you by Sprint. What unbelievable postseason action we've got going on so far. This is 2K Sports as we get deeper into round one of the playoffs. For the Phoenix Suns, they have the lead against Denver. Get out your brooms. They're looking for a clean sweep of this series with a win. LeBron's been going at it effortlessly against the defense of the Nuggets. He has 17 points, been dialed in from downtown so far. For the Nuggets, though, in this one, plenty of work still to be done. They're losing the battle on the boards. It starts with wanting to rebound. That's been a problem. Kyrie Irving off to a rough start. Everything's been rimming out for him. He's got to be frustrated. And that's it for now. Thanks for stopping in with us. It's time to head back to Kevin Harlan, Steve Kerr, Clark Kellogg, and Doris Burke, who are all ready with a call in the second half. The Sprint Halftime Report, presented by Sprint. And we welcome you back to our coverage of round one in the NBA playoffs. What can you say, LeBron James? What an impressive effort today. How about the opening half of basketball? He played so much riding on this game, and he came out and took immediate control. And that's part of what makes him special. In big games, he lays it all out there. He wants to be the one to win it or lose it for him. They've got Sarich and a terrace in at the small forward. That's the group for Mike Malone getting going here in the second half. 
They blow the whistle just as he gets it off. That's two points with a chance for another one at the strike. That finish brings me back to the old days, the silky smooth finger roll. He's their leader defensively. He's able to do so many things well on that end of the court and takes the pressure off everybody around him. An indispensable asset for them. And I don't think you can look past what a fearless player he is, too, guys. I mean, just look at all the charges he takes. Run out gets trailed by 19. Out here is Irving. Passes it to Hunter. Nurkic, guarded by Jackson. So he gets the whistle. Contact on the way up, and two shots coming up. The Nuggets shooting their sixth and seventh free throw attempts tonight. And he can't get the first one. Suns leading by 18. Now Smart backing down is LeBron. LeBron is doubled. Pass to Jackson. And here is Wesley. Feeds it to Smart. Six to shoot. And it's blocked by Smart. And they'll keep possession. And Zabuki. No good. He's got a nice touch on that shot normally, but good defense there clogging the lane. And here in the second half of play, we're just over a minute in. And it's Harris off the drive. Pass to Lukic. Stolen by Jackson. Fast break. Here come the Suns. And it's good. Fought through contact. Hits the shot. He'll go to the free throw line. You know, he'll make you scratch your head and throw your hands up as a defender. I mean, you just don't know how to play. The Suns have had seven opportunities at the free throw line and made good on five of them. And Denver has possession. Hunter covered by Wesley. And uh, we're about a minute and a half here into the second half. And the shot's good from Hunter. LeBron with it. He's got 20. As Ibuki is screen on Harris. Now here's Smart. Jackson setting the pick here for Smart. No good on the quick three. The Nuggets trail by 18. Harris picks the hunter. The feed to Irving. But three. It's hauled in by the Suns. Well, they've been better than good on the glass today. There's a glaring discrepancy between these teams in that area of the game. Yeah, and that's what's paved the way for them to build this big lead. No question. An excellent game we've seen from LeBron. He has 20 points, and he's buried a ton of three-pointers in this game, too. That's yeah, getting started. Keep track of just how many of those he's hit. And he can't make the second free throw either. Missing both. The Nuggets have gone one of three since starting the second half. There's the pass to Sarge. The Nuggets moving the ball around. Outside Irving. That's the lead pass. 
a little over two and a half minutes off the clock in this final half of play. Here's Wesley. Gets the 14-footer to fall. He's got 12. It was almost like he was surprised to be that wide open, yet he knocked it down. And it's Harris off the drive. Somehow ignores the tight D and gets the layup. Boy, that was impressive. Major height disadvantage, but he still got the shot up over his man. Well, he's got the poise to handle any matchup, and he's not easily intimidated. You can see that there. And the Suns call time. Well, he wants to get everybody on the same wavelength, that's for sure. And he may change up some things here as well. Looks to me like he saw something that wasn't on the plan, and pick now is the time to address it. I don't have a problem with that. And now we're three minutes into the third quarter of play. LeBron against Harris. Passes it to Wesson. And it's off from three-point range. Irving kicks to Hunter. Back to Irving. Irving gets a screen from Sarge. No good off the front line. Suns leading by 18. From downtown. It's all in by the Nuggets. Sarge has got six rebounds in the game. Here's Irving. Sarge passes to Hunter. Here's Saric from outside the arc. And it's hauled in by LeBron. LeBron's got his seventh rebound of the game with that last one. Boy, I tell you what, the complexion of this game would be completely different if he'd shot the ball anything like he's capable of. Here's Nurkic. Rebounded by Smart. Smart's got four rebounds now tonight. They set the pick. The Nuggets trail by 20. Denver calls timeout. You know, all coaches hate defensively when you give up easy points in the paint. That, that's inexcusable. So that, that's the reason for this timeout here. I think it came down to the fact they were getting beat inside. And that's why the coach called timeout. They were not winning the battle inside. Well, a solid blend of aggression and athleticism drove these small forwards to lead their position in block shots during the regular season. Fifth on the list, LeBron James. And that's a group of perhaps the most well-rounded defenders in the league. Solid on the perimeter with the ability to block shots on the inside. And that's the ideal makeup of a wing defender. The perimeter defense is really a requirement. I mean, you've got to be able to do that. But if you can also block shots like these guys can, you become even more valuable. And it's blocked by Azubuki. Dishes to LeBron. Leads him in there. And so it looks like the Suns will retain possession here. And the Suns making a change here. <laughs> Outside, Green. Off the screen. He squares up and sinks it. Green's got five now. Perfect screen there. Set him up with a nice look. Poor job by the defender to not fight over or around that screen. Ah! Irving. And count it. Two points with a chance for one more at the free throw line. And how did he get that to go? Even after the whistle, I like the awareness, the alertness, and the presence of mind to finish the play. All right, we'll all look at how the points have been generated so far. A scoring breakdown for the Sun. Well, their passing has been picturesque, a thing of beauty in both halves. More than a few of their baskets have come off assists. And how about the touch they've displayed from long range, guys? I mean, as a team, they are really shooting the ball well and executing from the perimeter. Kicks it to Jackson. To the point, and he converts the lead. As a broke, he's got 13. Took advantage of some shoddy defense there. They've got to at least get a finger on it. Johnson outside. He kicks to Irving. Here's the three. That one falls from off Johnson's feet. Johnson's got three assists tonight. You know, defensively, you cannot forget about him. He gave him a wide open look there. Here's Matthew. A feather touch on the finger roll. Beautiful. 
Five points in the game. Boy, that was a rugged screen set there, fellas, and the defense didn't even try to go through that one. Pass to Hunter. And there's another one for the Nuggets. And Phoenix has possession. 22 is their biggest lead. Shot clock at six. Back to Jackson. The Suns need to get a shot off. Here's Matthew. And Irving with the rebound. Irving's got his fourth rebound with that last one here tonight. Hunter battles through traffic and lays it in. And one points in the game. And his shots are dropping right now. This quarter has been very kind to him. Number 11, covered by Irving. Suns moving the ball around. Green, no luck. The Nuggets trail by 16. Irving up top. Defended by Abdia. All sorts of time. And that one hits back iron. I thought he'd make that one. That's his range and the defense nowhere to be seen. And it's going to be two free throws. Drew contact on the shot. The Suns have shot 60% from the line. 6 of 10. today as a whole and far too often that's the case for this team LeBron's checked in for the Suns and he sinks the second the Nuggets trail by 17. Outside Irving. The pass to Hunter. Shot from free throw range. No good. Great tee that time from Green. Green left side. Some solid defense there from Irving. That's an easy shot there. That's a shot that he should make more often than not. They grab their own miss. And the shot counts. He's fouled, and it's a chance for a three-point play. Terrific play right there. Great strength to finish through the hit. That's how you do it, the bump and the bucket. The Nuggets have been coming through at the charity strike. They've made seven of their eight attempts. Williams is checked in for Jackson. The free throw off from Hunter. Suns lean by 15. He dishes it to Green. Back to LeBron. Count the bucket coming off a perfectly placed assist. LeBron's got five points now in the quarter. Here's Irving. He's got eight. He passes to Hunter. To the inside. Perfect. And he jams it with authority. Takes advantage of the situation there. And he feeds it to Green. Hits the three-point bomb. Green's got eight points. You know, even though he doesn't really have the long-range ability uh, on a consistent level, he can knock down some open ones. Outside Irving. Take it, Irving. To the middle. Here's Mukic. Nine shot. No good. Suns lead by 18. LeBron with it. And it's Johnson picking him up. Fades back. Again, Phoenix. Denver's gone 2 of 5 with the three-point shot since coming out of the break. The dish to Barton. Passes to Rukic. He's against Williams. Faded and away. No good on Nurkic. Phoenix has gotten one of six three-pointers to drop since coming out of the locker room at halftime. 
Number 11, defended by a hunter. Boy, the prettiest play in basketball to me, executed to perfection. I don't think you're going to get an argument there. Everybody loves the alley-oop. Well, unless you're the team getting dunked on, of course. Pass to Barton. Feeds to Johnson. No good again that time. He's not necessarily a strong inside presence, but he needs to polish those chances off. They're doing a great job of not giving the ball away, and that's a big reason why they're winning. The Suns making a switch here. The feed to Mills. Back to Irving. Uncovered. Oh, and that one had the right spin on it, and it is good. Irving's got 10 points. Clearly, he's shaken off that cold shooting performance of the first half. Dishes it to Williams. Suns moving the ball around. Kicks it to Smart. Fires the three. Another three for Phoenix. Well, it took him a long time to get that three-point range. Maybe this will get him going. The Nuggets shooting approximately 43% in the third quarter. Irving gets a screen from Nurkic. Irving attacking. And here's Mills for three. And it's Phoenix with the rebound. LeBron's got nine rebounds in the game. Getting it done. Here's the screen. Here's Carson. Misses the three. The Nuggets shooting about 42% so far. No good. Now the Suns take it the other way. This one for three. With the rebound. You know, even though he missed that three-point shot, I think the defense has to do a better job of challenging the shot. Yeah, because you know if you continue to give up open looks like that, that you're in big trouble. And they'll probably let the clock wind down here. Exactly. No need to give the ball back before the end of the quarter. You know, that's a case there, Kevin, of him making a pass to a spot, and then he let his teammate run right into it. Well executed. Johnson goes in. He kicks to Barton. That one falls, coming off Johnson's feet. Barton's got 10. But three quarters of play all in the books, and this one all but over already. Western Conference first round deciding game. The Oklahoma City Thunder go. And we're back to the action here in this round one matchup. Suns leading by 23 on the court for the Suns. Jackson is out there with Williams. Then there's Smart, and it's Wesley in at the shooting guard. Smart. Pass to Wesley. Shoots the three. Gets the bucket. He's had an off game thus far, but his team has been able to pick up the slack and find a way to get it done here. And so here's Denver. And here's Irving. And the pass to Hunter. A finger roll finish at the bucket. He's got 25. Good defense, but you gotta love the finish with the finger roll over the top. The Sun shooting 51% from the field. They'll take that. Here's Wesley and the rejection by Lucas. Here's Mills. He's guarded by Williams. And Mills puts the charge. Taps in the tray. Here's Wesley. It's going to be out of bounds. The Suns will retain possession. The Suns making a switch here. Now, smart. Outside Jackson. Right side Jackson. Five on the clock. Here's Clarkson. Rejected by Hunter. 
Irving picks the nose. Back to Irving. Pass to Hunter. Here's Sarge. And it's Phoenix with the rebound. He's always going to have a difficult time finishing when the defense is in his face like that. He dishes it to Smart. Here's Clarkson. Gets it to go from beyond the arc. He's starting to heat up from outside. That's his second this half. Nuggets have gone two or three from the field to get the fourth quarter start. Just a little under two and a half minutes have passed now here in the fourth. Inside, out of bounds, Phoenix takes possession. That is not a difficult pass. You'd think they could keep it in bounds. LeBron, he's checked in for Phoenix. Corey Joseph comes in for Smart. Phoenix has gone two or three in the fourth quarter from long range. Good shooting so far. Here's Wesley, covered by Mills. Nasty. Absolutely filthy. And the building is stunned, partner. He dug deep into his bag of tricks there. Yeah, I hope he keeps that one handy. I want to see that again. And goaltending is going to be the call. So they get the basket there anyway. He didn't get to that one quite in time, Kevin. Those can be tough to gauge sometimes. And the Nuggets making a change here. The Suns have gone three of five here in the fourth quarter. Pretty good numbers coming out of the break. LeBron takes to Joseph. And it's rebounded by Lukic. The Nuggets shooting 43% from the field. Connor, the pass to Irving. Takes the three. Phoenix grabs the miss. Jackson's got his third rebound on the night. Joseph with the ball. Now guarded by Nance. And a little over three and a half minutes in the books so far here in the fourth. Here's Wesley. And so he draws the foul on the shot. A trip to the line to shoot two. Yeah, the referee's all over that one. No doubt about it. Clearly a foul. Nothing to argue about there. And he knocks down the first one. And the Suns here with a different look. Both free throws good from Wesley. Over three and a half minutes through the final quarter now. Take it to him, Mills dishes to Johnson. And the bucket counts, and his eyes way to the free throw line. Try to make it a three point play. Heard the whistle and still kept his focus, able to knock that down. And that is not easy, Steve. I mean, to take the bump, to maintain control of your body, and put it in the hole, tremendous play. Here's what Denver's going with right now. Hunter's checked in, and Kyrie Irving subbed in for Harris. And that one misses. Phoenix has gone two or three in the fourth quarter from long range. Good shooting so far. There's the line for the hook, and it's Williams finishing it off. What a beautiful pass to set that one up. The pass might have been pretty, but the finish, I thought, Clark angry. That's a heck of a combination. Pretty pass and an angry punch. I would call it an irate finish, even. Irving kicks to Johnson. Pass to Hunter. Six on the shot clock. Back to Johnson. Puts up a three. And that one's good. Johnson's got five points now in the quarter. Something starting to click for this team, guys. You can feel it. The three-pointers are dropping. Their offense is flowing. They've had a great second half from long range. Number 16. He's guarded by Johnson. Number 16. And the Suns tack on two more. The Nuggets have gone 5 of 7 from the field since the beginning of the fourth. Strong work at that end of the floor. Outside Irving. Fades away. Rejected by Wesley. With 
at the lead pass. Here's Joseph. Goes back up. And it's Williams laying it in. They have got to put a body on him because otherwise, with his agility and athleticism, they're not going to be able to contain him on the offensive line. The pass to Hunter. He feeds it to Nance. Passes it to Hunter. And again, Denver with the triple. Back-to-back -back threes for him. The defense is slacking off a little. It does look like their energy is lacking at this point. Now, here's Joseph. He's guarded closely. Wesson. Trying to answer back, but that three is off the mark. Pulls it up. Rebound by Williams. Williams has got rebound number nine now. What an effort here tonight. And that one's good. They are not rotating nearly quickly enough on defense down low. Got to get quicker there. And even if it costs them some foul trouble, I mean, they need to start putting some bodies on bodies. Be physical. Johnson, the pass to Mills. Back to Johnson. The kick out to Irving. Just five on the clock. Off target from three-point range. The Suns have gotten more than 58% of their attempts to go down for them in the fourth quarter. They're 7 of 12. Pass to Wesson. Shot from the wing. Gets the front of the rim and out. Even though he isn't having the best of games from the floor, it hasn't seemed to hurt him. Cut the bucket. And I like that move to go here with the user speed. Go around the bigger defender. Phoenix has gotten off four three-pointers in the final quarter, and two of them have fallen. And the Suns call time here. And the Suns making a change here. Smart's got nine points here in the second half. Pass to Sarge. On the wing, Nance. He passes to Sarge. Trying to come right back with a three of his own. But it's no good. Here's Smart. There's the dish to LeBron. 16 feet away, and it's wide right. It's off the rim. Denver's gone 4-7 with the long ball here in the fourth quarter. Hunter, the pass to Sarge. Feeds it to Nance. Here's Sarge, covered by Russell. No good from Sarge. Not a bad look at the hoop, just couldn't get it to bounce in for him. Down low. Oh, took the contact and tried to throw it down over the top. But instead, he'll shoot free throws. Yeah, nice body control there. Narrowly missing the shot. It would have been a three-point play. Had a free look at it after the foul. Nice play. That's good from Jackson. The Suns making a switch here. So Jackson nails both of them. And here's Mills. There's the feed to Harris. Nurkic passes to Harris. 
Nurkic guarded by Jackson. The Nuggets moving the ball around. Rocket six. Baseline J on the way. No good on Nurkic. Well, I think he had all the space he needed. He just couldn't find the bottom of the net. Smart with the ball. Working on Nance. Well, he's been pretty safe with the ball for the most part. In fact, that's his first turnover, guys. Great defense. He anticipated the play and got there first. Yeah, I think he got there in time. Nice play. The Suns making a switch here. Williams is checked in. The Nuggets shooting uh, about 47% here in the fourth. Harris outside. Mills takes a three. No luck. Abdiya defended by House. Abdiya the pass to Smart. Harris is there. And there's the pass to Abdiya. Just four to shoot. Joseph drains the three-pointer. This game's over, guys. I think we can say that with certainty. Yeah, I agree with you there. We have officially reached garbage time. Harris dishes to Johnson. A minute 42 left in the game. Harris kicks to Nance. Back to Harris. Nance passes to Harris. That's good on the jump shot. You know, with the expectations low for him, uh, he can provide a nice lift when he does put the ball in the basket. Now, Smart. Dishes to Joseph. Kicks to Smart. Number 16. On the three off target. Boy, he'd like to have that one back. How's the pass to Mills? He kicks it to Johnson. He dishes it to Mills. Back to Johnson. He tries for three. And it's Phoenix with the rebound. He feeds it to Smart. Passes it to Williams. The dish to Joseph. Number 16. Sinks the three-pointer. Well, guys, tonight they came in here and really dictated the terms of the engagement, which is very difficult to do as the visitors. You're right. That's not usually the way things work in the NBA. It's a great win, and no question, it's going to be a happy plane ride out of here. Pass to Mills. From the wing. Rebound by Williams. The Sun shooting 53% from the field in the fourth quarter. Can't ask for more than that from your offense. Smart with the ball. semifinals. You know, Clark, every team has a bad night, and these guys might want to watch the tape of this game the next time they have a bad night to remind themselves how dominant they can be. Well, this is one of those dream-like games for a coach. That'll do it for now. Thanks for watching 2K Sports presentation of the first round of the NBA playoffs. For Clark Kellogg, Steve Kerr, and Doris Burke, and the rest of our 2K crew, this is Kevin Harlan saying so long as we leave you with the Jordan player of the game.